What's up everybody? Welcome to my channel. We're gonna play with some makeup today. Uh, I used to film videos like this about six years ago and then that abruptly stopped. And with all the free time I've had lately, I figured I'd start it up again. I've got everything set up. Uh, we're gonna be doing two eBay mystery box unboxings. One's kind of a like drugstore products, the other one's like verified higher end like Kylie, ABH, that kind of stuff. So we'll see what's in each one. I'm super excited. I love doing these. It's just really a good time. All right, stick around. All right, guys, I zoomed in a little bit. Um, it's just going to be basically holding up different products and uh, seeing what's in everything. I am going to be doing a video that's just using as many of these as possible. So stay tuned for that one. Um, I took off my glasses too. I could tell in just the intro that you could see the reflection from all my lights. So that was super annoying. Uh, I went ahead and took them off. Uh, first things first, we're going to get into the more affordable uh, drugstore box. So I'm excited for that one. Got some lovely bubble wrap. Oh, right off the bat. I noticed the last sensational this bad boy I absolutely love this mess here this is actually the one that I buy for myself all the time so that will be going in the key pile for sure next is a Maybelline City mini palette So it's got like two little purples, a blue, uh, looks like all shimmers. So that'll be interesting to try out. So here's another mascara. It came with the So Lashy Bold Mascara. And it came with two. Oh wait, this one is the same thing, just waterproof, which is always nice. So far three mascaras and a little mini palette. Wait, scratch that. I mean, four mascaras. Another CoverGirl mascara. Interesting. Interesting so far. I don't know. Next, we have CoverGirl Outlast Lip. There's two components in here, so I think one might be like a balm or something like that, like a hydrating of some kind. And then next we have two Stay Matte <clears throat> from Rimmel and one Fair Ivory, one True Ivory and I'm pretty, I'm pretty light so hopefully a combination of this will work for me. Okay this I actually love and I use a lot. This is the LA Girl Pro Contour Powder. It's got the highlight and the contour. I love this thing. I use this all the time. Love it. Ooh, I'm actually kind of excited to try this. This is the Maybelline Cushion Foundation. And it is in the shade Warm Nude. So hopefully that'll match. We'll see. And then here we have an e.l.f. highlighting duo. It's got the sticker right over the front of it, so I'm curious to see the colors of this one. Let's open this one. I do like the packaging. It's like that matte soft touch. Well, wannabe soft touch. Wow. That looks super chalky. I'm not sure if that's going to be great. Let's see. Okay, it's like a shifty. One's like a shifty pink. One's like a shifty purple. You kind of see them right there. We got like a pinky color and a more purple color. Interesting. 
not as chalky as I thought they were going to be, so I'm actually curious to use this in like a more colorful look since it is like a duochrome highlight. Interesting. Wipe it never happened. This is a eye makeup remover liquid from Alme. It's got cucumber on it, so I'm assuming it's gonna be cucumber E. It's got that like oil layer. And then the blue layer. I don't know if you guys can see. I generally like removers like this it doesn't ever like dry me out or make me feel greasy or oily so i'm actually really excited to try this one all right now we have an outlast all day soft touch concealer yay concealer okay cover girl outlast all day definitely gonna try this it looks like it's pretty similar to my skin tone so I might have to try it just as like a, I, I have really dark lids and really dark eye bags so I tend to use a concealer that's more full coverage over my darker areas um, and then I'll put a light cover like a highlight color over that so I'm gonna use this under there we'll see how that works um, next we have a Maybelline Master Strobe Liquid, it's highlighting liquid. I gotta open these highlights, I love these highlights. Uh, hello? There we go, oh, too much, too much, too much. Okay. Here, that is a nice blob of it so we can at least see the color it's like this like bronzy champagne where we go there we are it's like a bronze champagne now now that's it wet it might look a little different once it dries down but that's it for now all right and last but not least we have in a Remmel London instant flawless perfecting radiant skin tint so this is like a lighter coverage, not foundation, but like a tinted moisturizer. Some days you feel like a tinted moisturizer and some days you don't. All right, well that was it for the drugstore box. So that's actually not a bad little haul here. I did that. Put everything back in the box. I'm really actually curious to try that elf highlight now. There were literally four different mascaras, which like I'm I'm excited about this one because this is one I actually use like everyday basis. Like when I'm going to work, I will always have this in my purse, in my car, in you know everywhere. But four, that's a lot. Uh, this Outlast liquid lip, I'm excited to try. Contour is always bomb. There's lots of good stuff in here. Now let me not kid myself. I was super excited about this next box and when I opened it, everything was individually wrapped in tissue paper. So I couldn't sneak a peek even if I wanted to. Literally everything is pre-wrapped which is awesome it also came with this sweet little note it says Sarah thank you for your purchase I hope you love your items the approximate value of this mystery box is 172 enjoy Maddie thank you Maddie I really appreciate that no it's just like you know I spent 75 on this particular box so the fact that it's like a hundred dollars over that is just that's awesome and it came with the lovely like personal note and it's things like that as a consumer that I I want to repurchase from this person because they showed those little details so just throwing that out there okay that aside I want to see what's wrapped up under that note okay let's see 
We have Aloe Rescue Revitalizing Mask. And then we have a Dr. Jart Water Replacement Cotton Sheet Mask. Masks. Skincare, always important. Oh, oh, I can kind of see Kylie through this one. I was so excited. <laughs> I've never tried a Kylie product before, and I was super excited because I thought this was a lip kit. And it's not only not a lip kit, it is the eyeliner kit <laughs> in brown. Excuse me, dark bronze. I don't typically wear brown eyeliner. And the fact that it's like spring, like I'm not going to be wearing brown eyeliner anytime soon. But I thought it was the lip kit. <laughs> I was so excited for that. Alright, let's open this little pink bottle. This is Amazing Grace Philosophy Firming Body Emulsion. Oh, I think the philosophy of the company is on the bottle. I don't think it's called philosophy. I think it's just called Firming Body Emulsion. Interesting. Hopefully we'll firm some stuff. Next we have Bioactive Skin Care. Organic Virgin Olive Oil Night Cream. This is the package. Lots of skincare in this one. Smells pretty good. Smells clean. Smells a little florally, but not like choking, choking floral. <laughs> you know what I mean. All right, what's next? Ooh, some glow job. Some Too Faced Glow Job Radiant Boosting Glitter Face Mask. A ton, a ton of skincare in this one. I want to make it. I want to make them not skincare, though, bro. This jar. We talk about the packaging on this. Not a huge fan of Too Faced or their philosophy or like their aesthetic. I'm not like that like peach bottom chocolate bar. <laughs> I have some Too Faced stuff because like their products are bomb, but like I really don't like their philosophy and I don't want to get into that. But this is gorgeous. The mask itself is like a hot pink, like duochrome glitter mask. It's gonna fall out. <laughs> Yo, can I get some makeup in this box? Yo! Okay, this feels kind of promising. Feels like maybe a little palette, something. anti-wrinkle and um, energizing <laughs> energizing fucking eye masks oh this is from grace and stella though i i really i've always wanted to try some of their stuff makeup makeup Makeup, where are you? Where are you? Okay, here's the Kylie Birthday Edition Cream Shadow. The package. It's in the shade Copper. Let's open this up. 
Oh yeah, that's a really pretty color. There, okay. Woo! We got some makeup. Let's do the next one. Alright, this is a Makeup Revolution Ultra Strobe Balm. So like a liquid highlight or like a balmy highlight. Not like a liquid. Since it's clearly a balm. Now, I don't know how to feel about Makeup Revolution right now. They're in a little bit of trouble as far as components go. I'm not a huge fan of either party but I don't think that's right what happened so this is like a balmy pink oh god this is not good what is this okay we're going in it's like creamy right so like that's unappealing and then where is it? It's kind of like this like creamy pink. It's very sheer. Super sheer. Like unnoticeably sheer. It just makes skin look sparkly. My finger for some reason is like bright pink. Weird. We're just gonna put that one over there. What is this? OMG Pulling Gel Double Dare. I'm not sure what this is. OMG Pulling Gel. What is pulling gel? Strawberry seed exfoliator. Oh, it's full. Exfoliator. How to use. Apply a dime size amount of gel on a clean, damp nose. Gently massage in a circular motion. Yeah, so it's a little exfoliator. A little strawberry seed exfoliator. That's kind of cute. Smells like strawberries. That's cute. Skin care. <laughs> what is going on? This is a box full of skin care. And make a revolution, which ain't nobody wants that. Okay. What? What? Why? Why? I don't. I don't want this. Kind of bummed. Some Morphe X Britney Bear News Contour Kit. So it's like three little brushes it's got Britney Britney bears directions on the back I don't really nose contour as you can tell I get a big old lumpy lumpy schnoz so I don't know how to feel about this like I'm gonna try it and I'm gonna do it just like her instructions um I'll do a video on it maybe nose contour for the newbies nose contours for people who don't contour um, I don't know like I have Morphe stuff I'm just not a huge fan of Morphe also and this doesn't really scream like high end to me but next <laughs> a makeup revolution tote bag Again, I just, I don't, I have no dog in that fight, but like, it seems pretty sketchy. Well, there's all kinds of goodies in here. Let's see, we got a NYX professional makeup little bag. It's got like little lips on it. Ugh. So this is cute. And inside it's a little mascara, a little NYX mascara. I love these travel mascaras because it just gives me an opportunity to like try a different one without spending like 
a million dollars on mascara. More skincare, I'm assuming. A cute little ABH lip gloss here. It is in the shade Vintage Lip Gloss. It's like a rose, dusty pink with some like glitter in it. Ooh, I, for I always forget how flippin' pigmented ABH glosses are. This is a gloss, yo. This is like a liquid lip. Crazy. So there's the gloss. You can't really see the glitter reflex in it, which I like. Because I'm not really glitter on the lips. I'm not really glitter on the lips kind of chick. Let's see, we have a Tarte Park Avenue Princess Bronzer. There's a Strawberry Peppermint Kovas lip, lip Balm. Kovas? Kovas, am I saying that right? Strawberry Peppermint, that's gotta be an interesting combo. Let's see. Yeah, that's weird. <sighs> Strawberry peppermint. It's very balm, very liquidy, very liquidy. All right, we got a ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in I Love You. It's like an orange, and then it's got some like pink, orange glitters in it. I'm not a huge fan of the Super Shock formula, but I'm gonna use it. Ooh, okay, I've always wanted to try one of these Too Faced Melt Liquid lips. So there's that color. It's like a dark, dusty, rosy, dark, dusty, pink, mauve. It might be a little dark for me. I don't usually wear quite that dark. But we're gonna do a look for sure. Okay. Next is a Clinique makeup remover. That's always good. Clinique is bomb. Bomb skincare. But skincare nonetheless. Thought this was makeup. Thought this was makeup, but it's cool. No worries. Whatever. Some samples. Clinique foundation. Uh, Briogeo sample, Blossom and Bloom Ginseng Biotin Volumizing Shampoo. What else is crammed in here? Cover Effects, Cover Effects samples from their foundation. And last but not least, all right, this is pretty awesome. This is the Daily Microfoliant by Dermalogica. This is, this stuff's dope. It's like a powder, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's like a really fine powder and you just kind of like wet and rub it in and this stuff's bomb. Okay, I'm gonna separate everything out, see what kind of makeup we got, see what kind of skincare we got. All in all, that last box, it seemed pretty good, but with the exception of the two little bags, the little NYX bag and the Revolution bag, and the trio brush set here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight makeup items. And let's be honest, it was ColourPop, Makeup Revolution, NYX. So four, four higher priced items. I don't know. 
there's a lot of skincare in that box so kind of bummed kind of not I still got some really good finds it was still a lot cheaper than if I were to go to the store and get these things I just wouldn't for me personally that little $25 drugstore box I would definitely buy it again it's just fun to like open a little present especially um, with everything going on lately. I'm actually pretty impressed with. There was a couple of foundations. I'm really excited to try this cushion foundation. These stay mats right here. Like I said, these con this contour powder I use all the time. So yeah, I'm pretty excited. Um, for the more inexpensive box, the more affordable box, the drugstore box, but I'm just, I'm a drugstore kind of girl. I'm a ball on a dime kind of babe. I hope everybody's staying safe. I hope you enjoyed my little, my little eBay haul. Uh, it was a lot of fun getting back into filming. It's been several years, but I'm glad to do it. I'm happy to entertain myself mostly get some creative outlets and uh, get some juices flowing some I don't know that was gross um, that's it for the video today guys I uh, hope you have a good one thanks for coming and hanging out with me for a little bit uh, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more from me I'm definitely gonna put a full face together I'm gonna fill in my collection with do mostly these products out of these boxes but you know it didn't come with everything we didn't get powders we didn't get lashes the whole night so gonna make sure I get that one out for you as soon as possible hit that thumbs up that always helps the creators we really appreciate it uh, thanks for hanging out on my channel guys have a great night bye <laughs>